Hi everyone, this is Meir. I myself registered to the conference and I must tell you I really enjoyed it. The person I would like to refer you to, beside myself, is Peter Ruter. What a wonderful man. You know the phrase making lemonade out of lemon. That's what we are attempting to do in our place with all the problems we have in it, with the water damage. We want to make it better than it was before. Why not? We built it 20 years ago and it was so wonderful. Now we want to rebuild it, thanks to the damage. <laughs> well, he was fired from his engineering position. And instead of having sadness, feeling terrible, like most people feel, as if they're dying or something, he said, oh, that's time for eye exercises. And he came to one of my workshops. And as they say that a student sits on his teacher's shoulders, that's a very known Zen description, means the teacher knows whatever he knows, the student knows what the teacher knows, and better. He did fantastic charts that I'm going to buy from him. Fantastic charts. Better Tibetan charts that I haven't seen. Fantastic charts against astigmatism. And it's like a toy room, his room. He was able to help somebody with 10 diopters to go down to one diopter. And I can tell you, that's a real work on what's called high myopia. There was also Ray Gottlieb there. And as you know, all of you, I'm really admiring Ray Gottlieb. I have interviewed him uh, for our YouTube channel uh, as the Dean of Color Therapy, is a PhD in psychology. But when I met him and we worked together for nine months, I just came from Israel and he finished optometry school in Berkeley and he was basically persecuted and chased by the optometry profession because he dared believing in the Bates method. It's amazing. But he decided to hold on to his belief, got rid of his nearsightedness, and many people say that presbyopia is just um, a normal condition. Well, I'm going to have a presbyopia uh, workshop next week to help people get rid of their readers. But the main thing is he invented an amazing chart to get rid of presbyopia. And he has such wonderful scientific dogmas. I must tell you, in Argentina, I met two beautiful ladies who are top ophthalmologists. And one of them, who is a specialist in uh, working with cross-sightedness and doing surgeries for cross-eyedness, was able to train the head of her ophthalmology department in the Bates work and taught him the exercise of palming, where we rub the hands and put the hands around the eye orbits. Now, why do I want you to go to this conference? The reason is that so many people have been persecuted to bring the truth to the world. From the time that the person who invented the button was ostracized, to the time that the one who invented the wheel had problems, to the one who decided that the world is round, went to the Inquisition. Remember? Copernicus. And he had to retract what he invented out of torture. To us, who brought a new truth to the world, that should have been an old truth, was old for the Tibetan yogis, but new for most people, that vision can improve. And we have been all ostracized, persecuted, and we were strong and we stood up. And we succeeded to survive. And here is the survival. Already close to 7,000 people from 101 countries that speak English are looking at the conference. I want it to be 8,000, because then the 22,000 who look at the Spanish conference that I was involved in, but then my words had to be translated to Spanish, 
We will be 30,000 people. What a good beginning. Do you remember the idea of the 100 monkeys, that 100 monkeys were in one island, and they learn how to peel bananas, and without meeting them, monkeys in another island did the same thing. We have millions of cells in our brain that are there to imitate others. And if we learn that vision can improve and teach others that truth, we will be able to bring a new consciousness to the world. And then it's only technicality how we'll come to the world. So, you will see 20 different teachers. 10 of them, among them myself, will be this Sunday, for those who registered for the um, conference, we will answer questions directly. I've done it with the Spanish conference. I will do it with this one. It's going to be 10 o'clock Pacific time. So look at the different varieties. If you're bored with something, skip to the next one. There are 20 of them but you will definitely not be bored with most of them. And I really am urging you, by your very presence, by your very registration, to bring up the idea that vision can improve naturally, and there are many people who think so. That can change consciousness. Many blessings to all of you, Mayor.